The backdrop behind me says, drink water. Um, it's less of a command and more of a, just a declaration that this is something that we do. We drink water to remain healthy, um, and water rights are very important. So it's important for us to drink water and keep our bodies healthy. What I'm going to try to do in class today is um, communicate the idea of alternatively using water as the healthiest drink um, for hydration and also convey the ideas of healthy living through art. My name is Julie Hadnot. I'm with All In Alameda County and my art is Life, Water, Love because I believe that if we love ourselves and we're living a healthy life, we're drinking water. Hi, my name is Selena Wilson. I'm the Vice President of Organizational Effectiveness at the East Oakland Youth Development Center where we provide free after school and summer programming to young people all the way from age five to 24. For my art, I wrote Water is Life and depicted the Orisha uh, Yemaya who is the among other things, uh, known as the mother goddess of water in the Yoruba tradition. So I wanted to represent that. And I think just the idea of water being life uh, not only reminds us the importance of drinking water, but of respecting mother nature and our sources of water, particularly here in the Bay Area where we're prone to drought. My name is Lydia Yamaguchi. I work with Oakland Unified School District Health and Wellness Programs. And I did this art that is Water is Life. Um, this year our work has been focused a lot on the theme of Water is Life and inspiring folks at school sites to think about and act on the value of water as essential for life and essential for learning. And we've been also doing some student art, enc encouraging students to um, create designs related to Water is Life, so I felt like I should also take on the challenge of creating art in that theme. Um, we know that water is essential for life and for learning, and so we want to help people make that choice and have access to water um, where they learn. My name is Michelle Payne, and I'm the executive director with Community Youth Outreach. My art is promoting water, and so it says, fuel your hustle, trap water. So the whole idea of drinking water is to fuel your passion in life to do the things to help yourself and help your community thrive. Hi, I'm Debbie with the Green Lighting Institute and happy to support Alameda County um, youth programs to drink more water. Uh, my art, I was just learning how to do graffiti art, so I love the experience, very creative, very warm. Um, just tried to put in colors and words that say and reinforce drinking more water. My name is Kimberly Wells and I'm the Chief Strategy Officer for Collectivo. The art I've made today is Don't Believe the Hype, Drink Water. Um, as a part of Collectivo, we are the preferred marketing partner for the City of Oakland in promoting the healthy uh, campaign for the promotion of sugar sweetened beverage. So my message is to not believe the hype of all of the marketing that goes on around soda advertising. And it's really more about style than substance. And our goal here is to bring that level of style and to promote drinking water for healthy lifestyles. Don't believe the hype, drink water. Hi, my name is Steven Chen and I'm uh, with All In Alameda County. My art here is Water is Life and said with uh, multiple languages. So the first one here is Sue for in Mandarin for water and then it's water and then it's agua in Espanol is life and there's kind of elements of life with a tree, uh, clouds and a sun. So we know that our bodies are water and our and our planet is water and we got to do we got to get the water in us and and keep the planet alive and us alive. Uh, with art, the reason I do public art is because I think it's important to transform the visual landscape of your community because it informs you in terms of your practice. And if we have ads and billboards promoting unhealthy lifestyles or promoting the fact that we should be eating a lot of processed food, soda, and drinks like that, then these are the type of things that people are going to consume into their consciousness. If we can control the visual landscape with something that is positive and healthy, we can help transform that. And I think art and mural painting is a beautiful way to address it and a beautiful way to engage people's thinking and conversation and transform the overall behavior of the neighborhood into something that's conducive for health and growth. 